Hi guys. Today um, I've been having some trouble with a shared slide that I have um, that I've given editing rights to hundreds of people, which I did do on purpose. Look, I'm getting notifications all over the place. Um, but I had to turn it off, and now I'm going to get a million notifications about that. I need to turn those off. <laughs> What I'm going to do today is um, show you guys how to uh, make a copy and share it to where it has to do a forced copy, okay? Um, so first you're going to go up here to um, the file button and you're going to go here and make a copy of the entire presentation. Okay, now I am going to put today's date. I'm just going to put the date and this because I've already shared it with many people. And I click OK. Um, now it is creating a new copy of that. My document had a, a, almost 200 pages in it, so it's just taking a second um, to do that. While we're doing that, I will go ahead and show you this. So um, this is my front page. It has the instructions on it. And then as you can see um, on the side over here, I have different chapters in this. Um, with things that I have gone ahead and removed all the white from them. They are now transparent images and you can use those when you're creating um, Bitmoji um, classrooms. Um, and there you go. Other, I usually share this with editing right so that other people can add in things. As you can see right here, um, in my rugs today I open it up and these are newly added from other people uh, and that's why I share it let's see if it is opened up no it is still take oh there we go okay so now you can see up here in the name it says copy of 53120 bitmoji items so this is the one I want to share. Now I'm going to go over here to that share button and I'm going to click it. And right here I have it as restricted. So I need to change this. I'm going to go in here and I'm going to click right next to my school district and I'm going to put anyone with the link. And now over here with viewer, I want to change that as well. I want to put editor and then copy the link and done. Now, if I want people to have editing rights, I will continue to use that. However, um, if I want to share it, Without editing rights, I am going to put it here. This is our group Bitmoji craze for every for educators. So I'm going to put it right here and right here where it says sharing. I would leave it like this if I want it to have editing rights, but right now I don't. I'm going to put copy and post that. And I just left them a little note. And ta-da! Now when they go to open that, now it's not showing my picture right now because there's still a lot of high traffic, sadly. But see? Ta-da! Um, now they have to copy it. 
and they would hit this button and then they have copy access. So thank you guys. Hopefully this solves the problem for me today and shows you guys how to do it. Bye.